YouTube, this is Big Ray 20. What you see here are my two power acoustic Edge 10,000 watt amplifiers. I'm running some tests today. I am clamping the amplifier. Right now, they're powering my two Soundstream Triple X 15s with custom Pierce Audio product soft parts. These subs are dual twos, wired to one ohm per amp. I'm only testing one amp at the at the moment. So I'm only clamping one, one output. There's nothing clamped on the bottom amp. This is the same thing I did with my Soundstream Triple X 6500s. I clamped 3750 out of one Soundstream Triple X 6500. So when you multiply that by the two that I was running, I clamped a total of 7500 watts between the two. So I'm clamping one here. So the output that I get today will have to be times two to get the max output from both amplifiers to my subs so I'm going to be testing using my tablet here with the ultimate car audio app um, tone generator I'm going to be doing 45 Hertz first then 40 35 and then lastly it's going to be 30 Hertz just to figure out what kind of output I'm getting from these two amplifiers at different frequencies so I'm going to be trying this 45 Hertz first in order to get now this one is clamping AC amperage and this multimeter is AC voltage so you multiply these two that you see here the highest number you see you take those two highest numbers and you multiply them to get the wattage and then those two same numbers, you divide them to get the ohm load. So that's what I'm doing here now. And this is 45 hertz. Let's see what kind of power these put out. Alright, so that's... That's 45 hertz. Now I'm going to be doing 40. That's 40 hertz. Now this is 35 hertz here. 35. And lastly, 30 hertz. 30 hertz, if you can see it. So let's see what they can do at 30. So remember, the two highest numbers between each meter multiply to get the wattage, and those same two numbers divide to get the ohm load that that watt that the um, amplifier did the that power at. So I'm gonna do the math um, a little bit later to find out exactly what kind of readings I get out of this amp. Now remember, this is just one amplifier being tested, only one. The second amplifier, the bottom one, there are no meters to that one. So the power we get, like I said, would be times two because they're both game matched so whatever this one does this one is doing the exact same so if this is doing 200 watts then it'll be 200 plus 200 which is 400 so let's stay tuned for the results hope you guys like what you see it's all peace and love thanks for watching